Day two, so I am just carrying on with uh, digging out the old wall. Um, foot in doesn't look that good, so I'm just gonna rip it out basically and uh, start again. Uh, so I'll get that down as soon as possible and then start building with a base course. Weather's holding up, so that's good. Um, it was supposed to be raining till about sort of 12 o'clock today, like last night it was hammering it down, but fingers crossed and uh, touch wood. I've got no wood, banana, that's class as wood, isn't it? Uh, it don't start raining now because like I said, I just want to crack on, get a footing in and at least a good strong base course and then it's just going to be easy building with this one. It's nice big blocky stone. I'm just going to probably start on the end um, where I've put that new post in, get that nice and straight and then probably just start working backwards like just go, you know, probably just like a course or two, step it up a course or two um, on the end basically and then just come into it like so. But yeah, no, it's uh, it's all right. I think the uh, rest of the walls, like I said um, on uh, yesterday's video, it's uh, it has all gone. Um, but I think just because of like, you know, I'm going to get basic sections done. So once again, I'll just build this section as a freestanding section, um, just so it's on its own, not don't connect into it too much. You know what I mean? Obviously I will connect a little bit, but like I say, it's just, I want to really seal it because um, that ivy within the other walls you know i'm basically not letting that get into uh the new section um because it will be uh well packed and uh sealed should we say so anyway i'm gonna finish my brew me cup of yorkshire tea and uh yeah crack them today and actually get some building because yesterday was uh boring but you've got to do them um you know you've got to do them days like i say preparation is key and uh yeah so now i'm literally just got to finish that little bit it's you know just Get it all done get it nice and deep you know you know what i mean straightforward building anyway without further ado let's crack on
boom, boom, shake the room. Righty, that is uh, where I have got to. Uh, just trying to keep it lovely and coarse. Well, actually, I will be boom snap on the money once I've got up to this line, basically. You can just see it there. So what I'll do, I'll keep running up all the way to this line. And then that is dead flat then. And then what I'll do, that little gap between the line and that stone above it, I'll put a fin course in. And then hopefully, then on this band on the old wall, I can then run a course in and that will look lovely. Then that'll be about ooh, coming up to about half of the wall. And then that will just really make it flow in, you know, the two walls meeting basically. But no, it's all good. A bit worried about the stone um, because what has come out of this wall has got to go back in. And I've got this pole up there and some down the side there. But not all of it is pretty. So we're going to have to play around with some of it dress some of it up you know get it looking good but it's all right it's all part of it it's just a it's all right at the minute i've got the uh the pick of the stone light but as everything good things come to an end so uh it is what it is but um like i say so we've got to go back in somehow i don't think we've uh, there's no new stone on this site so yeah it's all good fun but yeah no like i say just keep keep it coursed um and then as long as i get over halfway sort of maybe nearing about a quarter I can then uh, sort of round them up the pattern like so. But no, we're doing all right. We are doing all right. We're keeping it dry stone effect, basically. So oh, what I'll do, I'll just sort of rake back the mortar just because I know that wall there probably was a point. Yeah, it was. Well, unless it's been repaired, basically. But it looks like it was a pointed wall. So, uh, but obviously it's all blown. Well, there's no mortar in it now. So we just want to keep it the same sort of style. Um, so, yeah, like I say, the uh, customer wants it dry stone effect. That's all right. It's a nice, nice, easy way of building, really, and it's strong as well. So, and also think it looks really good. So, that's the main thing. But no, we're doing all right. Nearing about mm, probably after that course, probably be about a third um, of the uh, of the height. So that's all good. Like I say, can have a little play around with this stone and see what we can get out of it. It's just bits like that, you know. You can't really, you know, you can't be putting that in the wall like that, you know. Like imagine that's the face can't really be doing that so because look how thin it is so what i'm doing is just sort of knobbing it in half and then just putting the tails in i've got quite a few in this wall already so just to keep it you know i just want to you know this one is about strength really we sort of neutralize the wall here because like i say the rest of it's uh, not very good but like i say it's just a repair it's just a repair but uh this bit will be lovely and strong it's all going off well i love it all right anyway i'm gonna go finish my coffee slurpy work that down and then uh, crack on with this afternoon and uh yeah see what happens righty let's do that and uh let's go Just about going in. Righty. Just starting to pack up. That is me done for today. Main aim of the game is uh, just trying to get it to tie in with that wall there. So that section. So I think we're doing all right. Like I say, that is dead flat now, that course. Um, so it'll be lovely and easy to build. Stone's getting a bit limited, like, you know, but we've got to use it all. So we'll make it happen. It's just a... Uh... Oh, I'm getting attacked by a wasp. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> I've just literally been attacked by about four wasps. Oh, I've not run so fast in my life. Anyway, let's get back to it. I had two wasps on my neck then, and uh, I do not like wasps. Worst ever pain I've ever had is getting stung by a hornet. Oh, I was close then. 
Ooh, anyway, yeah, nice straight line. So I'm keeping this dead straight. Um, I'm, only, I'm only doing the last stone that's going into the uh, end wall. I can't go over that. I need to get my breath back. <laughs> wow. Oh, I just had two, literally two wasps on my neck and then one trying to fly into my face and then one coming at my kneecap. Wow. Right, compose yourself. So yeah, so that'll do for today. Uh, like I say, keeping it nice and straight. <laughs> um, <laughs> and uh, yeah, not worrying about that end bit. I'm just going to kink the last stone in because if anything happens to that end bit, boff, it goes down or whatever. This will be strong and it will stand fine. Righty, so that's it. Going to head home. Try not to get stung anymore. That's the old wall. Yeah, she's uh, it's standing all right, you know. It's not too bad. Like, it's just... Uh, got some uh, bit got it's got a few problems like but it's still going but i've never seen this for a top either it's like a ballast mix like a sort of you know what you put down for a footing or it looks like mortar and it's been pebble dashed like you know stones chucked at it so it's the same here as well uh, oh i just noticed that as well but i think that's helping much really that's basically a tree i think actually is that ivy i'm speaking to uh the gardener and i believe that's uh that was how big the ivy was it was absolutely caked in it so that's the problem now they've sort of cut that off it'll probably still shoot out of there so they haven't actually properly killed it you can only really kill it if you properly spray it but anyway yeah so as long as it ties into this wall well that sort of style you know what i mean and then uh which i think it is which is good you know old new but like i say walls always look a bit funky when they're low once to get a bit more height on that, I think that'll start looking nice. You know, start sort of getting a bit of, yeah, look to it. Right, I'm gonna go home. Well, finish packing up a minute, gotta move all that. And uh, yeah, tomorrow is another day and uh, we should be sort of heading towards, hopefully over two thirds tomorrow. Cause it'd be nice to get this done by Friday, like, you know, a nice three day build. Um, yeah, I think that'll be good. That stone there is absolutely lovely as well. It's the perfect width. I think it's quite a wide wall, this like, but uh, you have a look. She's lovely. Uh, you know, bend around a little bit, but you know, absolutely lovely. So uh, it's nice to get a few of them going through, like, it all helps with strength. Just like a through stone to a dry stone wall. Righty, anyway, I feel like I need to go now. I've just, uh, I still can't get over them wasps. Literally can't. I think one got me actually. Oh, righty. Tomorrow's a new day. Lovely jubbly. Right, anyway, over and out. And uh, see ya in a bit.